What's up, y'all? It's Debbie, and I'm back with my draft from the online elimination and the online group play, which I advanced to Burbank, and I want to go through my thought process in this draft. Playbook was easy. Tennessee got a good bunch. Has deep corner, probably my favorite play in the game, so I picked that easily. Now, the running back round, I got a kind of average running back round. There's no LaShawn McCoy. There's no Ezekiel Elliott. So it was kind of like picking babies. I went with Melvin Gordon. He had the highest juke and decent speed. Next round, Demarius Thomas, good big body catching receiver, tra or catching traffic wide receiver. Got to pick him to go. Here we go. I got two tackles. I, I like to have two tackles in the center. I probably took Lane Johnson because he's an eagle over Donald Penn. This was a hard pick here. Like I said, I like two tackles. So I'm thinking about Conklin. I know Michael Bennett's a beast, but I feel like they give you a lot of D linemen in draft. I really only need three. I have a three four book, so I really only need three linemen. If I can get both of my tackles down in the first four rounds, I feel good. So I went with the tackle. Here we just pick a fast DB. Like the, if you can get an 87 speed DB, nothing wrong with that. And here we go. We get our anchor on defense. And Umdamakan Sue is a dog at defensive tackle. This was probably my hardest pick of the draft right here because I, I know, know Marcel, Marcel Darius is, is just, just as, as, as big a goon, goon as Umdamakan Sue. But, but because, because I picked, picked Sue earlier, I didn't, didn't really, really want to have two slow guys rushing, rushing the passer. passer. I also, I also check Bowman to see what my linebackers were. I'm not a big Bowman fan because he's not that fast. So, I didn't really want to pick him. So, it's kind of coming between Darius and Ziggy. I've never played with Ziggy, never had him on my team, so it was hard for me to really pick him because I never used him. I didn't know if he would perform well for me or not, but because he had 82 speed and I couldn't have two fat guys on the line rushing the pass, so once they get free, they got to be able to track down quarterbacks. I went with Ziggy. And here is a snap pick at quarterback. I got to go Derek Carr. Mobility over everything. He makes so many plays for me. Here is a, a solid corner in Xavier Rose. Good size, decent speed, physical. Here's another one. Harrison Smith, big hitter, decent zone, great height. This is another one. I went you go Jim Rams again. Physical, tall, corner. You go there. This is a tough pick because this is three good players. Now, right now, I only have one wide receiver which is Demarius Thomas. I have one running back. I wouldn't mind having two running backs, but then Travis Kelsey is just a stud tight end. I mean, you really have three stud players. You have a wide receiver that's going to be open and catch the ball. You have another running back, so I can have dual running backs. And here I go checking Kelsey against my base tight end. Kind of need to play making tight ends. Kelsey's a great card. 82 speed for tight end. His motor is really good. He's tall, catching traffic. He can make things happen after the pass catch. And I know I got up here my running back with Gurley. Because Melvin Gordon's not that good. And I know they're going to give me a couple more receivers. So I went with Kelsey. Go ahead and secure my tight end position. And here in the next pick, I could have if I went. If I went with uh, Jordan Nelson, I could have went with Greg Olson. But I don't want to go backwards. Boom, boom. And here we go, another pick. Got to take an edge rusher here. Think about a guard, but I, I already have a, you know, I have a, what you call it. I have two tackles. So I picked JPP, who was a dog. Love JPP. Also, also got like when I was in there, my man Fletcher Cox, Cox a big Cox, who was a monster on the line. But I already had three linemen. I'm in three, four. Wound up picking the guard, then I'm going to move to center, and I'll tell you why in a little bit. Here you go. They always give you Travis Benjamin and Kenny Stills. I was just picking one that had a speed receiver out there. There I go. I'm completing my wide receivers. This was a really tough pick because I know Whitney Merciless gets after the quarterback. He has 91 power move, which is over the threshold, just like 91 zone. So he pass rushes like a maniac. But I only had one linebacker, so I have to pass on Whitney Merciless. It pained me. I knew he was a great card. He played so good for me. But I need two linebackers. You know, I can't go with three forms, just one linebacker. Here, my last pick before the legend round, another fat guy, another average D-tackle. So I pick up my, my 50 DB at the time. Which is with Darius Webb. I have no 91 zone, but you always pick the Avenger in the last round. Krause is the best defensive player in the game. Me. So I'm happy with that. Happy I got him and not Rodney Harrison and Ronnie Lott or even Ronnie Barr. I like Krause over everybody. So offensively, we feel really good. We got three wide receivers. Like I said, I love having two tackles for the pass protection and a center. So we only have one good interior lineman put him in that center because that's the main block on inside zones, on dives, on everything. He's the most important player when running the football is your center. So I got Ramon Foster, 90 pass block, 90 run block, put him in the center to secure that spot. 
then you figure out which one your baseline is going to do best with, you know, strength, run, block, whatever you want from your interior. Most of the time, my three interior guys, I want to run and block. So I'm going to find who has the best run and block and plug them in there, you know, let them go to work. So we have Kelsey at tight end, we have Melvin, uh, Melvin Gordon at running back, he's going to work for me, and Derek, I love Derek Carr. Good, two good wide receivers in DT, and the other guy, because then the speedy guy in Kenny Stills, was a pretty solid offense, you know, really no holes. Defensively, I have exactly what I want from draft. I have three down linemen, I have two linebackers, I have six DBs. You know, I have four of my outside guys, my two safeties, my two corners are really solid. They're not 91 zones, but they're just a notch below it. I would like to call them the mini Avengers. Harrison Smith, Jalen Ramsey, also Xavier Rhodes, and then of course I like Krause. Love Krause. He's the best DB in the game for me. Mark Barron is a savage linebacker along with Quan Alexander. And Ziggy Einstein, JPP are really solid as rushers. And like I said, Don was just really holding down the middle. So this was the team I went ahead and played single elimination. And I played group play with this team. So that went through my thought process in drafting this team. Hope y'all enjoyed it.